The beta of my updated loot filter is out. It's out to explore. The motifs of 3.0 have been very much kept the same, but there have been quite a few adjustments. If you haven't seen it before, we use a white flag system for highest tiered items. You have green flag is next, and then blue flag, and then yellow flag, and then black colored flags. Now the yellow flags used to show with a circle on the minimap. They no longer will show as an icon. Most of the time, uh, black items can be ignored, but some players will want to pick them up. Most people want to pick up yellow tiered plus. Part of the reason I developed this loot filter, of course, was influenced items. Too many were showing, so I've sorted them. Only eye level 83 plus will show. Mapping system, a little bit different. Um, you'll see they look the same, white and yellow maps, but show up differently. Maps are shown with a square icon on the minimap, and you'll see white versus yellow. Um, low tiered red maps will have the yellow colored text, and then we'll have tier 15s in pink still, tier 16s in red. Splinters have been adjusted, and so you can see um, they'll highlight differently. You only need 20 now to show blue tier. Val skills, in general, and unidentified rare base jewels um, still show with that white color that most players will ignore. Some players will also ignore yellow colored print on the black flag, but some don't want to ignore those. Now I've simplified uniques. Uniques, of course, have a different font color to differentiate them, generally a white font color or brown. The yellow uniques will show with a star still. I'm not getting rid of the icon for uniques, only for div cards, only for base items, everything else. I did drop the green flag for uniques, and so everything's been adjusted accordingly. You'll see more black flags in general to ignore, and you'll see um, a little bit more blue flags. It's kind of the theme. 